Hello guys, Salt Gamer here, and today I'll be reviewing Ground Control to Psychoelectric Girl. This is another anime series that most people probably never heard of. It was kind of popular when it first aired, though. In this anime, the protagonist Makoto moves to his aunt's home because his parents have decided to go overseas. When he gets there, he meets his cousin Ariel, who tells him a shocking thing. She tells him she's an alien from outer space. Though he doesn't believe her at first, he learns about Ariel's past, and it does sound very odd. Right away, I was intrigued by his semi series because of the mystery surrounding Ariel. I really want to know if this weird girl is actually an alien. The way she acted in her weird past made it very hard to know if she was actually telling the truth. It was funny seeing Makoto try to convince her that she's human, and seeing Ariel keep telling him that she's an alien. I couldn't wait to see the direction this anime series go next with the story. That's where this anime series went downhill quickly. This great mystery is solved in just the first three episodes, and just felt like a sudden and anticlimactic answer. It was like, really? That was the answer? Afterwards, anime turned to a boring slice of life anime series with multiple girls having romantic feelings for Makoto. It was beginning to feel like a horror. The mystery and plot that got me interested in Sammy's series in the first place were now gone. Now all we get to see is Makoto spending his everyday life hanging out with multiple girls. It was just typical slice of life scenes where you just know there won't be any major romantic development at all. At this point I just stopped caring about Sammy's series and was just not enjoyable to watch anymore. Another girl named Yashiro appears later on the show and this anime hinted that she might be an alien which again brought up the question of if Ariel is an alien or not. I really didn't care at this point. This anime should have had Yashiro appear early on, instead of having so many pointless slice of life scenes. These pointless episodes just made me lose interest in the show. In terms of characters, they are good characters. Makoto is your typical average main character. Nothing about him stands out. Ariel was a funny and weird character that was entertaining to watch in every scene that she was in. Yashiro was another great character that brought in so much energy into this anime series. Mifune is an energetic and positive girl that just makes you smile whenever you see her on screen. My Ka was an interesting cool dear character and had a funny conversation with Makoto. Mei Mei is Makoto's aunt, and she was certainly energetic and found odd ways of teasing Makoto. Her behavior leaves you in disbelief. The opening and ending song for the semi series were average. The music for the semi series wasn't that good. The image style and animation looked okay. I'm very disappointed with the semi series. It seemed like it was going somewhere with its plot and mystery, but it just turned to a point in slice of life anime series. If it was just gonna do that, then it should have been an over the top comedy anime series from the beginning. Why tease the viewers an intriguing mystery, only to give out the answer so quickly, and make the rest of the anime series feel so pointless? I give this anime series a 5 out of 10. So, that's all we'll talk about for today. Thank you for watching the video. Have a good night to wherever you are, and please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and please comment if you found anything interesting in the video.